What's up, my people? This is Big Trizzy. We back. Gearwig channel is back. Here with you once again for another gear review. We love these reviews. We love bringing these pieces out to you. And as you can see, I got a new uh, piece here to share with you uh, from Eddie Bauer First Descent. Uh, their line. And this is the men's BC Sandstone Stretch Jacket. Right? Uh, if you don't know Eddie Bauer, you know, they have a full line of Alpine equipment, outerwear, um, and this this line right here, the Sandstone line, is primarily soft shells. So you have different weights of soft shells, you have more heavier weights, and um, this falls, this BC Sandstone falls in the lighter uh, category of their soft shells. I've had this jacket for about a week now and since day one I love it all right and the reason why I love the jacket is because it's so light and soft all right so if you, you know if you're looking for a jacket that is just just really light gonna give you a, a good amount of protection in terms of, uh, of rain and, and, and light wind um, you definitely want to look at this jacket. All right, you take a look right here. Look at the fabric. Fabric has just a beautiful, soft feel to it. Nice emblem here on the sleeve. This fabric is Eddie Bowen First Descent's proprietary Weather Edge Plus stretch fabric. All right, it's a three layer fabric. And to tell you the truth, it does not feel like a three layer fabric. It feels very durable for its weight. I'm gonna be very honest with you. You know, you have some light pieces out there on the market that they feel light, but they feel like, you know what, if I rub up on something, uh, you know, it, the, the, the piece might rip or, you know, it might just get damaged. But this material feels very durable for its weight and it's very light it feels like it's constructed very well which you know are my first impressions of it to tell you to, to tell you the truth all right um, I, I really like this jacket man ever since day one when I put it on it's just super light and comfortable all right um, it, the fabric is nylon it is rated at 10K, 10K for breathability and waterproofness. Um, and it's four-way stretch, which means that you're going to get a lot of mobility out of the jacket, reaching for stuff, articulation. Everything is going to be very comfortable inside the jacket. All right. And I was able to wear this jacket out in some light rain and rain just beads up on the outside they say it's waterproof it's waterproof to 10k it's not the highest level of 20k like a, a regular alpine shell but if you get caught out in some rain for maybe a half an hour or so it's not like a downpour of rain you should be fine with this jacket all right um you know today it's a little bit chilly i have a fleece on underneath this uh, just because it's a little cold outside but um you know for milder temperatures mid 40s upper 40s well into the 50 degree range if it's going to be a little cool you want to have a nice light piece to throw on maybe if it's going to rain or even some light snow you can definitely throw this on all right very very comfortable I had to I had to come out and give you guys a review on the jacket because uh, my first impressions of the jacket uh, I'm loving the jacket already you know I'm one that I don't really like heavy jackets but I like to have a jacket if I'm gonna wear a jacket I like to have something that I know is gonna be comfortable it's gonna protect me if I get caught in the rain and it's gonna breathe well all right and as you can see here on the inside very nice craftsmanship here with the stitching we have some nice mesh here in the pockets to help breathability 
You have a nice pocket here on the inside. No Napoleon pocket on the outside, but you have one here on the inside, which I'm thankful for. I love to have a nice little pocket on the uh, inside or outside of the jacket in addition to the waist pockets because if you have money if you have a, maybe a small phone keys especially you can keep them separate i hate having to carry everything you know when i'm leaving my house in two waist pockets it just weighs down the jacket um it makes it you know make puts all of the bulk here in, in, in these side pockets but um really really loving the jacket man you can see here we have aqua guard zippers. We have a flap here to keep out any kind of water and wind. Um, I did wear this, I think, yesterday. It was really, really chilly in the evening and it was windy. Um, you will, in like chillier conditions, feel the cold in this jacket if you don't have proper insulation in on the inside. But this jacket isn't geared for that. This jacket is geared for your more milder conditions. Like I said, upper 40s mid 50 degree weather um, when there's still a little bit of wind still a little bit of chill in the air still a little bit of a uh, chance of, of, of light precipitation um, you know you can definitely wear this and be comfortable all right zipper is nice and smooth zipper garage you have velcro cuffs here Help cinch out the wind. You have a nice draw cord, a one sided draw cord at the waist. All right, and you can pull it through here. All right, as opposed to cinching it this way. All right, you don't have two sides. All right, it's only on one side. But very, very impressed with the jacket. These are just my first impressions of the jacket. I really want to test the jacket out in some real rain, which I think we may get today or tomorrow or in the coming week. I'm going to try and get out and give you some, give you a look at it in in the rain, so you can see how well it, it, it'll hold up. I think it will really hold up nicely in the rain because, like I said, um, a couple days ago when it was raining and uh, it was lightly raining, the water was beating up very nicely on the outside of the jacket. All right, guys, um, let's talk about the hood. I think first Descent and Eddie did a great job with the hood. You have a little bit of elastic here on the sides. You have one adjustment here on the back. All right. You have one adjustment there on the back to keep things simple and nice and really just cinch down the hood um, when you want, right? Very comfortable hood. The hood comes and it outlines the outside of the face very nicely. You don't have to worry about a lot of wind and everything coming into the jacket. Look at the jacket, man. Nice blue. Ascent Blue from Eddie Bauer. Right now on Eddie Bauer's site, this jacket is $299, but they have 50 off, all right? This is the week of um, April 1st, April 2nd. So, you know, go on Eddie Bauer, check them out. You get 50 off, all right? So this jacket is 150 right now, and it's a great buy, all right? You're gonna get something comfortable. You're gonna get something stylish in a great color. And it will protect you from, you know, uh, the elements in these milder conditions of spring and early summer. All right, guys, they have two colors in this. It comes in this ascent blue and then it comes in like a gray color. Um, but very impressed with the jacket. They did a great job with the hood. They kept it minimal, but they also gave you some storage and some pockets. And, um, you know, my first impressions on this jacket are a good one the real test to me now since they said that it's waterproof is testing it out in the rain so please be on the eye out for that as soon as it rains i'm going to try and get out with this jacket give it uh, you know some real paces outside in the rain and then the elements and hopefully get some video of that 
so you guys can see how well it holds up when it's raining outside, all right? If you guys have any questions, any comments on the jacket, please let me know, leave them down below. Any of our guides have tested this jacket, they're happy with it. So this jacket has been out in the field, it has gone through some paces, but you know here, here at Gear Wave, we gotta, we gotta give it the real deal test so we can let you know how it really, real life is gonna do when you go and grab these, grab this jacket. So if you're thinking about going to grab this jacket, I would definitely, uh, you know, go online, eddiebauer.com or go to the store and check it out because I went to the store last week and they had them in the store. So if you have an Eddie Bauer store, you, they probably have them in your store now. If not, you can go online and you can get 50% off. So it's about 150, I think with tax, it's like about 160 and change. All right, guys, but definitely worth checking out. I had to give you guys a review. Um, and then a little piece of rain fell here. As you can see, look at it beating up on the outside. All right, but keep your eye on the channel. We're gonna be back and we're gonna try to give you a look at this jacket outside when it's raining so you can see firsthand from the Gearway channel how this piece is gonna handle precipitation. All right, guys? Subscribe, follow, hit me up in the comments, anything. This is Big Drizzy with Gearwave, guys. I'll check y'all soon. Peace.